mother accidentally steps through a piece of music, but the young son was inspired. Back then there were no special effects in films, he pierced the film with a needle to create the sparkle effect of a gunshot. The first time he showed it at school, he conquered his classmates and his father who came to see it. Since then, he has been working on special effects. He dug a hole and added a slab, and he poured dust all over it, so that when he stepped on it, it exploded. Bury a bunch of firecrackers in the earth to simulate the strafing effect of a bullet. Add a blood pack, a war becomes more realistic, but Sammy wasn't satisfied. He felt that something was missing in the gun battle alone. He asked the actors to add a scene. All the men in his platoon are dead, and these are the men who work for you, your family. They died because you ordered them to. They had unconditional trust in you, with love for you. Now, you're just looking at this... at this thing that you've done. And... You can't save them anymore? Because they're all dead. The actor understands. In one of the final shots, he emerges from the wreckage of a soldier's body, with a heart full of sadness, across a flat field of bodies, and so he walks away. Seeing the actor's back, Sammy was silent. He was struck by the scene. It turns out that cinema is not just about fighting and killing. He had never thought that a simple shot could make a film so rich. The actor was so deep in the scene that he was crying. In this moment, he really became a platoon leader who had lost all his soldiers. He didn't get over it until the end of the shoot. Cut! It was an experience that set Sammy up for his future as a master filmmaker. Another screening. The realistic scenes once again shocked the students, and the long shot at the end was a real hit with everyone. They had tears in their eyes. That's the emotional value. Afterwards the mother ran to him. She wanted to praise her son for his achievement, but he turns away in disgust, and his loving uncle walked right past him. His mother didn't know what was wrong with him. She was also the most supportive of Sammy's filming, and there is a reason for all the changes Sammy has undergone. Years ago, his parents took him to the cinema. It was his first experience of film. The realism of the scene blew him away to recreate the scenes from the movie. He asked his father to buy a toy train. His mother secretly brought his father's video camera. She let him film the scenes on film. He supported his son's hobby unconditionally. In order to film more scenes, he took his two sisters and found them at home, making a mess of the house. The toilet paper was used up by his son as a bandage for the mummy. Until a new baby is born in the house, the father made an announcement. He had something better in store for him. The family decided to move to Arizona, and the friend who had been with him and Sammy's uncle would stay here. The mother did not approve of her husband's actions, finally took his uncle with him and moved to Arizona. For many years, Sammy's hobby was more of a career, the emergency equipment he spent so much money on, but in his father's eyes it was a useless hobby. Until one day, his mother's mother passed away. His father bought him brand new editing equipment. He wanted him to edit the film from the previous period. He wanted to make a collection just for his mother to cheer her up. However, during the editing process, something happened that caused him a lot of heartache. 